Good day viewers, thank you for joining us in this class. Here we want to solve this interesting equation here. Given that 2 raised to power a equals to 3 raised to power b, then we have to find the value of 16 raised to power a plus b over b. Now from here, let's work with this and multiply the power by 1 over b. And we have 2 raised to power a multiplied by 1 over b so we multiply the power on both sides with 1 over b so equals to 3 raised to power b times 1 over b we did that just to cancel this b on this side then this one will become 2 raised to power a divided by b so we have that a times 1 that's a then that's a over b equals to b has cancelled b on this side that's equals to 3 so we'll be using this. Let's note it down. Then we now want to evaluate this 16 raised to power a plus b, then divided by b. We have 16 raised to power a plus b divided by b. Now let's break this one down. And when we break it, we can see that this can be written as 16 raised to power a over b plus b over b so when we break that fraction there you can see that we have that and b over b is 1 so we can equally write it as 16 raised to power a over b then plus 1 in the power there and we know when we have this when we sum the power we already know that we have the same base multiplying each other and this can be split as 16 raised to power a over b then times 16 raised to power 1 that is what we summarize to this one that is when the same base that is 16 raised to power 1 when the same base multiply we can just add the power then therefore we have 16 can be expressed As 2 raised to power 4, we have 2 raised to power 4, 2 times 2 times 2 times 2, that gives us 16. Then raised to power a over b times 16, that's all we have there. And also, we can rewrite this. This can be written as we can change it, a over b can come in and 4 come out. We now have 2 raised to power. 2 raised to power a over b, then raised to power 4, still the same thing there, then there's 16. So we are saying the same thing here. Then we know that our 2 raised to power a over b is 3 from what we have done here. We cannot see that 2 raised to power a over b is 3. So instead of writing 2 raised to power a over b there, we can just put 3 here. So that's 3 raised to power 4 now. And that gives us 3 raised to power 4, of course. That's 81. And that's 81 times 16. And that gives us 1,296. 1,296. We say thank you for joining us. And uh, if you are yet to subscribe, click on the subscription button. And uh, bye for now.